Hello there, this is Bug Powder Dust. Thank you for joining me for episode 25 of Prison Architect Let's Play Alpha 28. So yesterday's episode, and in fact the episode before that, um, in fact it wasn't yesterday's episode, episode before last, I had a day off. Um, they both ended with our new legendary prisoner, Benjamin Richardson, causing major problems. In fact, yesterday's episode ended with him killing a guard. Um, I've done a little bit of reading about how to deal with this guy, and I think I really have to treat him like I would treat protective custody. So I'm changing him up to Supermax. He gets a nice uh, fetching burgundy outfit. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to bang him up in protective custody. We don't have any protective custody people in. Um, and I'm going to create a new regime so he doesn't get involved with any kind of working or any of that nonsense. So what happens to him is he gets shower, free time, eat, then he gets more free time, he doesn't get to work, force him into the yard, and then lots of free time, and he gets to eat and then go to sleep. And that's pretty much his day, as far as I'm concerned. Um, doesn't need a huge amount of time for eating. Keep the guy happy as much as possible. Uh, do you want to eat three times a day? Sure. As long as you're not being annoying and doing anything else, that's fine. Um, he's not going to need now to eat in the morning, so let's make that free time as well. So eat yard, free time, eat sleep. Yep, that looks good to me. I think that probably works. Um, what I'll do if I get a protective custody person coming in they can share the same block. I'll have to put up a couple of walls maybe and they can eat at different times. Apart from that it should work I think. So that's going to be Supermax. Um, I now need to um, un unedit this and make it kind of Supermax for now. Now he's Supermax. He'll get moved from out of here and he'll get put in here. It looks like I'm going to have to put in a solitary block in here as well because he's bound to kick off and be irritating. I don't think I've got space in here that I can see. Um, I don't. It looks like I don't have any space. So what I'll do, I'll create a solitary block here. I think. I don't think solitary needs to be inside. Uh, where are we? Solitary. No, it doesn't. That makes it easier. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to get. Um, how deep does it need to be? Door. It's back of the cell. Something like that. I'll just build one. I think for now. I'm going to have to dismantle the CCTV otherwise. Can't bother with that. Uh, or could, I mean, I've got plenty of space over there, so... Yeah, no. I'm, I'm just going to build one. I don't think I'm going to need more than that, to be honest. Although, you might say, well, if I'm going to do it, I might as well just build a couple. So let's think about it. Let's put a gap there. Let me see. So I'm going to put... Let's plan this. Probably quicker, isn't it? So, I'm um, going to put a door. And we're going to have walls uh, to there, so the cells will be rising up from here. So we'll have two cells. I can't imagine it being any more necessary than that. Um, like so. There we go. And we'll put the door in here instead. Yep, so that's going to be door, door, solitary, solitary. Job done. Yep, that works for me. So let's do that. Let's queue that up. The fact that I've been inside is nice. We will put down concrete tiles just for the sake of cleanliness. So let's go with that. Right. Um, on principle, let's search this guy. Just because. Now there's a whole mass of things I need to do. Um, thank you, I think it was Peter Vive, one of my subscribers, for suggesting I put a dog in visitation. That's actually a really good idea. I didn't think of that. Um, having a dog patrol in visitation means it should stem some of the flow of the contraband. So, good call. Need to get another kennel though. Um, where's my dog people? Ah, here we go. Really running out of space. I don't think I need these sofas in here, to be honest. That's just a kind of a, a nice to have. So, I'm going to get rid of those. going to get another kennel. Um, I'm assuming the rule of thumb here is one kennel per dog, but it's not hard and fast. They're not all going to be sleeping at the same time. So I'll get a kennel in there when those sofas have been dismantled. Let's get a doggy person in here. No, it's blocked because it's fog of war. Um, 
Oops, no, no, I didn't want to do that. Oh, I right clicked. It's very bad. A sack. There you go. No, the dog's been left. No! <laughs> he sacked the dog as well. There we go. Right, dog handler, can you come in here? So let's let's get this done. Um, remote door. Okay. I can just right click it, can't I? Um, so let's set up a patrol, a uh, dog patrol. We're going to do it along here. So if I just run this along here, you pretty much will get everybody at once. And then this one dog to it. Good. Spoon. There's a spoon found. Right. So now we've got normal prisoners wandering in and out of here. What? Oh, he's working. Okay. Is he working as well? Yeah, alright, fine. Don't have a problem with that. Wow, tons of blood on the floor here. Um, okay, so that's visitation done. Um, now, when does Mr. Richardson come out of here? Really? Do you, you want to... I wouldn't go anywhere near him, frankly, but you're a brave man than I am. Let's get out of there. Um, he's seriously injured. Hmm. Alright. Now, next thing we need to do then was put pool tables in the yards and the suggestion, so thank you for that. Um, that's probably not a bad idea, actually. So let's get a couple of pool tables put in the yards, so the short amount of yard time they do have, they can actually um, take care of one of their needs. Um, pool table. So let's stick one there, stick one there. And also up in Maxec as well. Let's get a little bit cramped up here, isn't it? Outdoor weatherproof pool tables. I don't think have been invented, but um, yeah, there we go. Anyway, right, so that's that. Um, I'm going to need to keep an eye on the whole Supermax thing. When's he going to get moved over? He's got... been locked down for 24 hours in solitary... Mm, okay. So he's going to be uh, banged up for quite some time. Let me just make sure I've got the deployment right. So this is Supermax, so he's going to come out of here and over into here. Now, all of his needs should be catered for. He's got family, he's got exercise, he's got entertainment, he's got showers, he's got eating. Oh, that's a good point, actually. We need to zone that back up as a kitchen. And as a canteen. Okay. There's a chef there already. There's not exactly huge demand going on, so that's all good. So that's most of that taken care of. Lots and lots of prisoners. There needs to be a bit more of a visual differentiation between kind of max and medium sec because they're both kind of shades of orange and yeah. I mean I'm not colour blind or anything, but still there we go. Right. What we need to do is get this dog over to here. Sniff everybody. Bulk of people. Give them a good sniffing. They don't like doing yard time, do they? It's kind of reluctant. Well, you know, if I got to. I don't know what's going on here. I'm, I'm guessing we need to kind of heal this chap, but I'm... <laughs> I'm not really bothered, to be honest. Stuff him. He killed a guard. Right, now where were we? We were in the process of um, setting up these expansion blocks, if I recall. Now yesterday we did um, canteen, so that was set up and took my off the ball because of the legendary thing. Um, that's right, we put the cookers in and we need to get them wired up, don't we? That's right. And we had a power station here which was feeding just these guys, so let's get that hooked up to the mains and we need to run uh, pipes down here in order to feed the water. So where's the pipes? There we go large pipes, get the money down to here, and then small pipes to feed the sink. So that's cool. Right, that's that done. Um, so we got fridge, we got sink, we got lights, uh, not lights, cooker, sorry. I think we've got everything we need. Are we good to go with this kitchen, do you think? 
Let's set that up overnight. Um, I'm going to get the um, furniture in, I think. That will be good. And then we'll actually zone it overnight. So that's the table. Let's need to make sure we don't block the doors. So I can't have a table there. Let's get a couple of benches in. Maybe we can clone it. Bench, 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 bench. There we go. Um, we can get one more table and a bench in the interest of saving a little bit of space. So we can have that there. Now we can get a table and a bench in at the end here as well. So let's stick a table there and a bench there. Okay. Um, we can do the same down here. So a table there, a bench, and a bench. Okay, cool. Now what I'd like to, I'd like to repeat this all the way across because then we kind of have a channel. So that probably works actually. Uh, clone, how far does clone stretch? Okay, not far enough, but it looks a bit, but that's good enough. Uh, have a gap down the middle of the tables. Don't really see what it did there. Did it do anything? Oh, we can't clone it because nothing's been put in yet, of course. Well, right, let's get rid of that and get rid of that because we know what's what's in here. We need to get these um, connected up to the, the electrics is in. That's just fog of war then. Okay, fine. Um, right. Oh, I got going. I'm still work. And loads of people kind of chilling out in here. Now, where do we stand with our needs for clothing? Hmm. Still not working brilliantly. Laundry's there, and our medium set laundry's down here. The guys are working. Maybe more laundry baskets needed? Let's speed things up again. So the regime, where are we? So it's still work time. Right, how are we getting on here? So the workmen are starting to bring in the tables and stuff. Got a long way to go, aren't they? Wow. So the canteen is really the first step. Then we're going to start doing the um, cell blocks because we can take the pressure off here. What else we got in this canteen? Are we missing anything? No, not really. So in terms of um, paths and things, let's get those down. Prepare the uh, little things. Um, also, that yard's fenced off, that's okay. It's been fenced. Wow. Finding all this contraband. So let's see, has our dog um, spotted any contraband today from visitation? Let's have a look. No, it would appear not. Alright, well, there's plenty of time for that. How's it going with these tables? It's really not. What are my guys doing? Oh, I see, they're having to come all the way around because there's no access from in here. Uh, okay. Let's, let's fix that. Let's fix that. So we're going to um, demolish that and also that. We're then going to set this access to staff only so these cheeky blighters don't come wandering in here. And that should speed up the ability to for the workmen to get stuff in here. Right, Eden time. Probably the last eat of everybody in this one big canteen. How's Mr Richardson doing? You're still locked up for... Right, so you've you've done your solitary and now you're in lockdown. So you're going to be escorted back to your cell, which is fine. Look back, right on cue. There we go. Welcome to your new cell block, dude. Very welcome indeed. Now, in terms of food, he doesn't have any food ready. So that's interesting. Why is that? Let's check the logistics. And the food distribution. Demand zero, supply zero. Okay, because he wasn't there yet, so therefore there, there was no no need for that. That's fine, I get that. In terms of needs, what have we got? Nothing particularly bad. Comfort's being dealt with. Food is not really being dealt with. That's because... 
There's no food cooking. What the heck? There's no food cooking and a bunch of people haven't actually eaten. 50% in fact. There's ingredients. Okay, what's going on here? Hmm. Interesting. There is no reason why these guys shouldn't be eating. So we've got a bunch of prisoners going to bed hungry. Okay. Well, that's not critical yet. All right. We'll have to keep an eye on that. Okay. So we've um, put a holes here, and that's really that has speeded things up considerably. So that's good. Okay. So once that's done, I'm going to um, clone these and then duplicate them. There we go. Right, so let me just make sure I've cloned that correctly. Yep, that's been cloned. Give a gap. More. And then more there. Give a gap. And there. So there as well. So I'm going to leave a channel running along here. And also I'm going to clone this as well. Put that there. Okay, so that's future-proof that canteen considerably. Um, I'm wondering if maybe part of the problem here is that we need maybe another serving table. I don't know. There's four in here. That's it's kind of enough. Now it's night time, which means it's cell search time. Now I can't remember who we did last, but the medium sec always seem to be a little bit keen on escaping. So I'm going to grab them next. Now they're going to get to sleep very shortly. A few minutes. Three, two, one sleep. There we go. <laughs> right on queue at 1.15. Okay, so let's get these cell blocks searched. Yes, cell block. And also cell block. And also the top cell block as well. Now, did I miss one? Yes, this has been treated as a separate cell block for some reason. It's interesting. Oh, because of the doors. Yeah, that makes sense. Alright, fine. So that's a whole medium set being searched. And there's, there goes something falling on the floor. Right, so while my guards are busy doing that, my workmen are busy creating the new canteen. What I'm going to do is I will make this live after breakfast, because if I do it now, the cooks might not be able to cook in time for, for breakfast, and so that could cause an issue. So I don't want to do that just yet. I also need to work out where the hell I'm going to put um, things like metal detectors and things, because we do need those. Uh, metal tech's going to go there. Also, we're going to have a gap there. I want to make movement into here as easy as possible. So, metal tech's are there, there, and there. Come on, find me a tunnel. So, that's that queued. Looks like the chefs are bringing stuff in. I don't know why, because none of this is. Oh, it's a, oh, because it's a sink. Right, okay. So rather than use the sinks over here, you're going to bring it to a sink here. Are these all busy? <laughs> Fair enough. Well, what the hell. Right, so the table's been brought in. The metal tech has been queued. This is going to be uh, a lower priority. Finding lots of contraband. Bad boys. Um, while we're doing that, let's just call in one of our informants. Uh, where are we? So that's intelligence, performance. We always use Benjamin Pritchard, but he's really good. 89% is pretty awesome. So let's, let's let's get him in. Get him, Mr. Pritchard. Which I believe he's in. Yeah, he's there. He's kind of sleepy. So I'm thinking maybe a couple more janitors. Uh, how much staff have we got? Janitors. Let's give him a couple. Janet is pretty cool. They like work 24 hours a day, they, and they kind of they do a bit of everything, as you can see. It's going to put a lot of um, a lot of stress on our guards unless I micromanage it here. As you can see, in and out with these. I wonder if maybe that that was the bottleneck with the um, dirty clothes. Is that um, we didn't just didn't have enough people doing it, and the janitors tr trying to catch up at night. Maybe just start catching up. Anyway, so I a lot of contraband, but no tunnels, so that's okay. How are we doing down here? 
Oh, hang on. Have we got our informant? We don't. Here, here he comes now. Okay, good. So anything tells us about medium sack I don't care about because we're looking for that now. I'm more curious to see about reputations I don't know about yet and also maybe any tunnels. Let's come into the morning. Let's go to intelligence and informants and let's see what he's going to give us. There we go. So it's a lot of high sec, max sec stuff. That's been arranged. Right, so off camera I've just um, scheduled those contraband uh, reveals to be searched, so that's all good, because I know that's not very interesting to watch. Right, coming up to the morning, no new prisoners just yet. Need to watch his food situation. Lots of stuff cooking, so that's cool. Now, how many space have we got? So, normal security, uh, 82. We've got eight, eight space for max, but it's saying we're two over on med, medium sec. Are we indeed? Well, it seems that it hasn't counted this as medium sec. Why is that? Oh, because I've put... Right, okay. I understand. I put holes in the walls, haven't I? Um, okay, that's not the end of the world, but I need to do something about that quickly in case prisons get put in the wrong place. I'm going to put that there so we can put in a door plus a metal detector. Don't think metal detector on its own will do the trick. Uh, let's hook that up to power. Stick it over there. There we go. And this metal detector here is going to get hooked up to the power over here. Has that been queued for it to be metal detector? No, it hasn't. Objects, metal detector. Bang. And also one there as well. And on that basis, we need a jail door. There. And also there as well. Right. Okay. Nothing's kicking off. Benjamin Richardson is now in his new digs, probably. Yeah, there he is. He's locked up and he's sleeping. Which is interesting because he should be having a shower, but he's in lockdown, isn't he? So, alright, fine. Now, the other thing I need to do is I think Benjamin Richardson deserves an armed guard all of his own. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to mark this as the armory. No, in fact it is done that already and I'm going to hire an armed guard. In fact, make that two armed guards. And I'm going to get them to patrol in here only. So I'm going to get one guy here, one guy here. Put down an armed guard patrol. Uh, where are we? Armed patrols. See this is where the game is a little bit confusing. I don't know what's what this is. This is probably just a normal guard patrol, isn't it? So let's, let's get rid of that. Right, let's get an armed patrol. It's going to go around here. And one guy can come out here and he's going to go up and around. Um, yeah, that's a bit confusing, isn't it? One guy, one guy. There we go. Okie dokie. Uh, where are we going? Guys, guys, where are you going? You're going back to your armory for some reason. No. Okay, you should be patrolling up here. So the guy's so legendary, it's... Oh, hang on a minute. <laughs> I didn't want to say patrols down there. Okay, that makes sense. So let's take them off that. Let's get rid of those. Now they should... Oh, they, they teleport. Where'd they go? <laughs> they teleported. Oh, there they go, they're rushing up there. Okay, fine. Good. So, now, Mr. Richardson, Mr. Legendary. Oh, hang on, everyone's done their food. What's happened? Took my off the ball. Food. Right, okay. What? No, no, sorry, they haven't eaten yet. My bad. They eat late in the day in my prison. Don't ask me why. Right, infirmary. We need Brave Doctor to go in. And deal with Mr. Richardson. Is he, is he moving? He is moving. There we go. Here we go. In you go. In you go. Let's get this guy healed up. I, I don't like him messing my jail up. What? Where did you come from? He was hidden under the bed. 
Pennington, go away. I just, this game. I mean, I know it's alpha, but still, it's funny. It makes me laugh. Right. Okay, so the, there's a lot of eating going on. Um, let's just keep an eye on the needs. Yeah, that's cool. It's coming down. Like Richardson, is he eating as well? No, he's not eating. He's still locked down. Um, yeah, that's not cool. Ah, oh, no, look, he's starving. Um, can I... Wait, what's it locked down at the moment? Eight hours. Can I reduce that to six, then? No, 14 hours. What? No, no. Oh, it's... Oh, it's added on. Okay, how do I... Um, I can't remove his... Damn. I can't remove his need... Uh, his punishment. Alright, well... That's not cool. What I need to do, then... Let's try and deal with his needs in his cell. So what have we got here? Hygiene, family, freedom. Okay. Um, Alright, so what we're going to do... We're going to get a... Phone booth. In his cell. And we're going to get a shower as well. So at least that will keep some of his needs down. Yeah, it's not great, but it'll work. That's been done already. Shower head. Uh, drains. Drains all around, aren't we? Alright, let's do that. Got to think outside the box here. Ridiculous amount of um, punishment time. Okay, so how are we doing with the food? I have an hour to go. Food's being brought out. Yeah, it looks like they're not meeting demand initially. But that's okay because this um, this area is finished now, so we're going to be able uh, to sort this out from now on. And this will be purely max sec, and this will be medium sec. We'll see how that goes. Right. Now that's finished. Let's get this up and running. Let's slow that down a little bit. Um, right. Rooms. Kitchen. Okay, that's kitchen and canteen done. Deployment. This is going to be max sec only. That's going to be med sec only. Kitchen's going to be staff only. Do we want to... well, no it's not. Because we, we want people working there, don't we? Um, deployment. At medium sec. And that's going to be max sec. And let's go to logistics, prison labour. Ten prisoners. Wow. Well, I think five is enough. And there's a couple in there. No, we don't want any prisoners in there. Right. Okay. So that should do that. How's our man doing? Oh, cool. That was quick. Great. So it's food, starving, hygiene, freedom. Alright. Let's get his shower hooked up. And let's zone that now as a shower area. Okay. So that's going some way to sort this guy out. But we need to... How long is he locked down for now? 11 hours. So that's two... Okay, so he's going to miss the evening meal as well. well. I can't do much about that, unfortunately. You can't remove a punishment by the looks of it. Okay. Right. Now, where were we? So, this canteen is now good to go. The kitchen here. Let's get in a cook or two. Cook or two. Let's remove that, because that's ugly. Where are you guys going? This is a kitchen, don't you know? Uh, let's have a look at logistics and food distribution. Okay, that's good. So this is doing only max sec. Okay, and this is doing only med sec, which is good as well. Deployment, so let's fix this. Okay. Right. And this needs to be zoned as well, because otherwise anybody can come in here. Why is that not playing ball? 
Oh, there's no door here, is there? Uh, well, like, this is shared. No. This has got this has got broken again, hasn't it? Let me work this out. This was actually working okay before. Um, doors or lack of them. The fact there's no door here I think is the problem. So let's stick a door on there. I think that will fix it. Yeah, that should do it. At least they can still get here, that's, that's the main thing. Right. Room requirements. Surrounded by walls and doors. It is surrounded by walls and doors. Oh, it's a shower that's causing the problem, I think. I have a shower and cell. Hang on, let's, let's test that a minute. Let's get rid of that. He's still complaining. It's surrounded by walls and doors. Uh, oh, I, I don't know why that is. Can anybody shed any light on this? Hang on, if I just... Um, if I dezone and rezone... And then rezone... <laughs> right, well something's broken this and I don't know what. If anybody's got any ideas as to why this is suddenly moaning, that it's... Oh, it's fixed now. Well, uh, yeah, okay, well look, I'll tell you what, let me try and force him into that cell again. Go back in here, please. In here. It's a cell, it's a lovely cell. It's really nice. Uh, let's make that shower and see if that breaks it. Perfect. Good. Okay, that's that's rehoused him. I'm not sure what that glitch was all about, but that's fine. Let's do that. Okay, cool. So now you can have a shower if he needs one. Okay. Um Right, has this door been put in? Door has been put in, yes it has. So we can now make this med sec again. There we go. Can we make this med sec as well? No, this is shared. Well let me do it. But look, they, they can still come in here, so that's not a problem. Doesn't make any difference. That needs to be locked open. That needs to be locked open. Um, so we've got one, one cook working in here on their own. Yeah, that doesn't do it. I think we might have some teething problems with this new canteen. So is that a gap? <laughs> that's, a, that's a big gap. Yeah. Okay. Let's um, let's deal with that as well. While we're here, let's do that. Okay. So one chef cooking here is not enough. Um, I thought the game would have kind of auto balanced this, but maybe we've got too many chefs here. Let's see what happens at eight o'clock or nine o'clock when the food food run comes around. Right, so what's going on here? So this... This is moaning again. How's he doing? He's on section two of starving. Um, okay, well... I can't do a great deal about this. Let's, let's unzone that as a cell. Because he, he needs to be in a, in a cell proper. Oh. Okay. What's happened here? This is that, is that a graphical glitch, it looks like it, doesn't it? So he's in a big cell here. Um, yeah, I don't know. Materials, demolish wall. There you go, let's get rid of that. And also, solitary door. There, and there. Right. So he's in this new cell. We're going to put in a phone. Because why not? Um, it's obviously the shower head that's causing the problem, I think. I, I don't understand why this doesn't work, but there we go. Right. Still only one chef cooking. She, no, actually, she's watching. These visitations. 
Where are they going? I don't understand. Oh, this is a, of course it's a way out here, isn't it? Yeah, that's not good. Hang on. What, what light? Where is it? Door dismantle. What we're going to do? We're going to um, put a what? You've got to be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me. How the hell did he get out? Oh. Well, of course he's going to escape. Oh, man. Alright, well, I can't do anything about that. What I do need to do is get this filled in pronto. Are you escaping? Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll just, um... I'll just wander about down here. Can we... Can we get... Is there a dog? Yeah, dog. Can we get you down here? Go. Go. You might be able to beat this guy out. If I lock that open, give you a bit, a bit of speed. Is he just going for the edge of the map, though? Come on, dog. Get down there. Get down there. Go on. Before he reaches the concrete. Go. Go. Go on. Get him. Get him. Yes. No, I think I might have actually clocked that by, by clicking in addition. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Oh. Magic side of the map. Yeah, well, that that was my bad for uh, clicking one extra and I didn't need to. Oh, well, whatever. Right, what we do need to do is sort this out. Is this, is this happening anytime soon, please? Q. Deployment. This is still should be staff only. Workman, you, are you doing something here? You, uh, you working on this? Dismantle the door? Uh, then we'll get to fill it in. There we go. Yes, excellent. Right. Fill it in, please. Lovely. What are you doing? Did you just collect something? Yeah, that's suspicious behaviour. Get you searched. Maybe he collected a, a throw in over the wall here. D looked a bit suspicious to me. Let's have a look. Get him searched. Did you find anything? Yeah, look at that. Somebody threw drugs over the wall. <laughs> uh, just had to be in the right place at the right time. Okay, so we've got some working going on here. So these guys are working in the kitchen, so we might be okay. Uh, what we do need, here, though, is some CCTV, as ever. Um, so let's get that. Let's get that plugged in. Utilities, CCTV. No, CCTV. Uh, let's put this around the right way. So it's going around clockwise, so probably one one here wouldn't hurt, and also probably one down here as well. Now, in terms of CCTV monitors, is it these ones? So that one's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That one's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And this one has three, four, five. Okay, so we've got a little bit of wiggle room in the top one, so that's fine. Let's wait for them to get installed. Yes, yeah, so we've got loads of chefs in terms of prisoners working here, which is cool. So if they need to get out of here, they have to come through metal detectors, so that's cool as well. I was planning maybe to put a door in here, I don't think that's necessary, so let's get rid of that. They do have to go through one of these to get out, so that, that's fine. Right, a little bit of free time, we've got some stuff cooking. I'm thinking it's probably not going to be enough, is it? I think, uh, yeah, I think I need more cookers. I've grossly underestimated the amount of food I'm going to need. Another three. Um, also, another couple of fridges. Probably couldn't hurt either. So let's get that hooked up with electricity. Yeah, good point. Don't actually need to just connect them all to just one. And they all connect each other. Right. We're going to have a supply issue. We're going to have some hungry medium sec, but that's alright. I'll, I'll fix that for the morning. Right. How are you doing over here, mate? Almost starving. Well, it kind of serves you right. Don't have a huge amount of sympathy. So, too bad. Good need, need a shower, though. You're smelling. Right. Food. How are we going to do in medium sec? Let's have a look. So we've got 16 there. 
Well, actually, we're not doing too badly. I think we might be able to cope with this influx. Let's have a look. A lot of prisoners need, need food. It's a little bit worrying, isn't it? Come on, let's get these stacks out there. Let's get these food stacks out. Come on. Oh, hello. Ford, what? Oh, <laughs> my God. Has he got hold of a gun? Jesus. So he came out of solitary and immediately went on a rampage. Um, okay. I'll tell you what I want to do. I'll lock him in. Damn. What's happening here? He's shooting everybody. No, 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 no. Get out of there. Get out. Because you're going to get killed. You are going to get killed. Get out of there. Go, 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 go. And no, no, get out. And you as well. Get out. Oh, no, 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 no. You guys need to get out. Lock shut. I'm saving your life here. Lock shut. Lock shut. Um, you need to get out. I think you guys are dead. I can't do anything about that. Lock that shut. Brave. He's killing all my staff. Oh my god. Okay, how do I deal with this? Um, this is the worst kind of scenario. I don't honestly know what I can do. <sighs> what am I going to do? If I bring in riot guards, that's only going to exacerbate the situation. Um, I'm going to have to just arm up with loads of armed armed guards and rush him. Ooh. I thought, honestly, that two armed guards would be enough to keep this guy under control. In fact, all I've done is I've fed him a shotgun. And there's a spare one lying there as well. Which is, uh, that's not cool. Okay. So more of the story is, if you have a legendary prisoner, don't guard him with armed guards, because all he's going to do is take the guns off him. I think that's probably a good time to leave it. So for a third episode in a row, we are going to leave it with Benjamin Richardson kicking off. This time, he has a shotgun. Mm. Anyway, hope you enjoyed that. If you did, please leave a like or a comment, and I'll catch you next time. Cheers. Bye.